I did the international internships and I went to Stockholm, Sweden. I decided to do the internship because I wanted to get more of like a hands-on experience versus a classroom experience. I uh, worked at the International Institute for Democracy and Electoral Assistance, short form is um, International IDEA. There was people from all over the world working in the organization and we all just got to know each other and talked about the differences between our countries um, and we were all really interested in democracy and the electoral process. So that was really interesting to see that perspective from more than one place. Not everyone is coming from the same place as I am, and it's always good to be aware of that, especially in a place like Toronto, where there's people coming from so many different places and they're bringing that background with them. Gaining that experience from other cultures, from other places in the world, will make you a more rounded person and will make you more fit to be the leaders of the world. At first I was really nervous, really scared. I didn't know if I'd be able to do it, but. After going there, I realized just how adaptable I was and that was actually one of my best qualities. I don't think I would have been able to find a place on my own if it wasn't for the help of York International. They helped connect me with um, someone who could find, help me find an apartment. I gave them updates on my experiences. They would um, email me and ask me, hey, how's it going? But you're gonna go and you're not gonna come back the same person because once you really put yourself out there and you test yourself, that's when you realize just how much you're capable of. Stockholm is somewhere that I want to live eventually and I would love if actually if I could work for International Idea because it had that much of an impact on me.